Hmm. Now to the uh, third lock. This appears to be another gate, but something is blocking it. Hmm. Let's do an investigation first. I believe I can dig it up with a pickaxe. Then let's get digging. Roger. This appears to be an. Eh, it's only it's only ten seconds. This appears to be an. Do it. Leave it to me. We done did the thing. Got the material. She got some ore. Let's move on. This game is forcing me to play sh sh freaking games. Area. Is that marble? Those flowers are winter irises. Oh. Wilted. Whoa. They need to be watered. At least you don't have to do any more digging. Dati, do you see that shrine? Shrine? That's humanity's last hope against nice. Hmm. Save us from the oppression of technology. Return the stone monument to the pedestal of the shrine. We should have all the materials we need to craft the stone monument. Okay. Please, Dati. You're the only one who can save me. You're the only one who can save this world. So make the stone monument and put it in there. Hey, Date. I am a hero. Is following Iris's plan really the best idea? We'll find out. No, but I feel like we're getting closer to the truth. Really? Let's go with it a little longer. We'll see. I will follow along for now. Well, we haven't we haven't reached that branching uh thing yet, so. There's a crafting table here as well. Oh boy. Oh yeah, we'll want to do a investigate first so we can get a timey wimey. The same crafting table we've used previously. A crafting table. Ah oh, no! <laughs> Fuck. I just wasted ten seconds. A crafting table. No, wait, 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 wait. Iris said that all the materials should be here, but... What's that on the floor next to the table? This is... the egg that came out of the vending machine earlier. Oh. We can use this! Okay, fill the monument with that! There you have it, Iva. Understood. Done. You could have given it a... <laughs> Oomph. Specifications for oomph not found. Please take the monument to the shrine. Do it. You can make Do it now. Dante. Before the world blows up. Leave it to me, Iris. Are you going to continue doing whatever Iris tells you? Iba, I get where you're coming from, but I want to believe her. I see. If that is what you believe. Do it for humanity. I exist to support you, Date. Let's bring this to the shrine. And I'm here to support you, Iba. You're a darling. This appears to be a pedestal. Uh, let's investigate so we can actually get something out of it, too. I am certain you are supposed to place something here. The monument Iris was talking about? Correct. My god. Are you absolutely sure you want to obey Iris? Uh, well, if it leads to a different branch, we'll we'll do it. This appears to be a pedestal. Understood. It will be done. <laughs> Excuse me. 
wilted irises blossomed. It blossomed? There were dead flowers outside. What happened to them? Did they blossom too? <laughs> they did. Oh, wow. This is... Miracle. In the language of flowers, the iris means good news and hope. The fact that you believed in me is good news. And Dante, you are my hope. I'm your hope? You might be able to use it now, Dante. Use what? There's the miracle of flowers. birth. Another rare drop? I suppose we dig here. Right. The color of this floor is slightly different. I guess we dig a dig a dig a hole. Uh, let's not use it on that one though. Oh, well. The color of this floor. It's only ten. All right, try digging. Dig a dig a dig a hole. Sixty-nine. <laughs> what is this? I've never seen anything like this before. Is it on the wiki? I'm gonna go check. Give me a second. What is this? Oh, I get it. It's a love bomb. That description is not in the game. Let's fight for the future with the power of love. Must be your own terminology for it. Use it. How? You need to dance, Date. Oh god. Oh, that's right. Again? Haven't I danced enough already? This is to save Iris. Please just bear with it for now. Alright. I'll just use this bomb somewhere over there, I suppose? Yeah, try it. Oh, where? I'm guessing way over here. There's a lot of monitors. We cannot move forward with the debris in the way. Let's investigate so we can get something else out of it. about this debris. It's... it's blocking the gate, but it seems to have come from nowhere. <clears throat> it's unnatural for sure. It's from the nether realm. Does that mean Iris is blocking us on purpose? Can she do that? What if this is also part of Iris's imagination? Hmm. Very interesting. Not forward with the debris in the way. All right, now it's time to reduce the time it will take in order to do it. Use love bomb. <laughs> Around here? Yeah. Dance, baby, dance. Do you want me to dance? Please. The power of love. <laughs> and flowers. What the fuck? What? Oops. Looks like I messed that up, didn't I? Okay, well, guess I'll just die and restart. What? I bet. <laughs> Wait, did we actually restart? <laughs> Place. Okay, let's regroup and keep going. As a video game character, experiencing death again and again is wearing me down. Iris is further away from us now. So when will you stop believing her? Dante, can you see that shrine? Iris, I'm sorry, did we make a mistake? No, you haven't. What's going on? Are we supposed to go that direction? Ah. Death was the plan to begin with. Iris? Are you there? We gotta dig to her. Ah, uh, aliens! <laughs> or... 
men. Okay, this guy's gonna be the final boss for today. No, stop! Stay away! Iris! Nice is coming! Dante, help me! Iris is in trouble. Is there any way to save her? Date, this is Somnium. It cannot affect the real world. That's not true. I saved Iris in Somnium once. If I don't save Iris here, Iris in the real world is in danger. Either way, we do not have the power to fight against the UFO. If you want to help Iris, we need to find a way. What can we do? Where do we go? That is a good question. Well, there's a gate over here. Maybe it'll have materials. It's blocked, but it must be the outermost gate. Without a pickaxe, there is no oh, way yeah. for us to waste energy thinking about this gate. But we got a timey wimey. Oh, mirror door. A mirror door. But I'm not reflected in it. Let's do that and dance in front of the mirror anyway. What? Power of dance. The most beautiful thing humanity has ever created. Dance is the only way to beat Nyes in the Wadjet system. The reason why your reflection isn't shown in the mirror is because of Nyes. My God. Trying to erase you and. Date. <laughs> Please do it. Understood. I'll do it. So is this actually going to do anything or are we just wasting time? <laughs> Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> this game's a little weirder than Minecraft. <laughs> like, what the fuck is happening? Oh, they made him dance. <laughs> Backup dancers. And they're all dead. <laughs> I think we did it. <laughs> it's thank you for finding me, Dante. Iris, is it really you? That star. So there's two choices after the Nax thing: defeat Nax or Nice, Nice. So. What's the choice gonna be? Iris's core. Believe me! Believe in me! Oh, what? Hey, even if we, like, cut it down by half. So, what would the other choice be? That's the only. Trust me. Seems like the only thing to do. Iba, touch the core. Touch it. Touch it. Yeah, I don't know. Some she she has her hesitance about it. I'm kind of wondering if we should have hesitance.
we 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 so we did the left route what would the right how would we what we would have to do with the right route wonder if there'll be another choice if we do it again awaken awaken the land forsaken awaken awaken So you believe Iris. So I'm guessing the other one is to not believe Iris, but how do we make that choice? Oh, maybe there was something else around there. I will find out once we have to go back to this thing again. <laughs> so something's going to happen. Either going to be good or bad. Doesn't matter. Uh, we need to go this route anyway. See what happens. Because awaken, awaken, the land forsaken. Awaken, awaken. Take what must be taken. <laughs> okay. Dun, dun. Iris, I'm sorry that I doubted you. Hmm? I believe you. Watch it, Nyes X00639. Are you serious? Hmm. And like I said, I'll fulfill your wish. From this moment on, you're under my protection. Then? Yeah, I'm your bodyguard. I'll protect you with my life, Iris. Dante! Thank you! <laughs> Thank you so Dante, are you delusional? <laughs> Apparently. My mission is to support you. Good. Thank you. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> this might be the bad route. Because uh, Iba is concerned. And that's not a good thing. <laughs> I have a feeling this is going to be the bad route for this timeline. So this is day five of Tuesday. All right, going back to their office. What? You stayed at a hotel with Tessa? It was a business hotel. It was a two-bedroom. <gasps> Don't say misleading things. We got two rooms, each with two beds. We did bathe together, though. <laughs> no, we didn't. What, what? What? Isn't your gang supposed to be clean? Why are you here, anyway? I see. I heard about the shooting in Golden Yokocho last night, but I never thought it'd be you. Hmm. Well, let's talk to Mama. When you told me you were coming, I made them leave. I can't let them see me with Tessa. Unfortunately, I don't have anything new for you. But, uh, I did find out a little nugget of info you might want to hear. What is it? I'll tell you, but, uh... Date, come over here. Okay. <laughs> Needs another request. I'll tell you, Date, but you gotta do something for me. Want to shake your hand again? No, 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 no. I, I did that already. I want to see her panties. What? I'm sorry. Seriously? I, I, I want to see Tessa's panties. I really, really, really want to see. You gotta let me get a peek. She's not gonna let you. Well, 
Can you at least ask? Unbelievable. Dude. <laughs> Iris, could you do me a favor? This guy wants to see your panties. <laughs> That's messed up, Date. I know Momo would never say that. Right, Momo? Yeah, 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 of course. Date, you evil pervert. Seriously? You just want a handshake, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. I, I tried to tell him. Ah, man. Dante, this, this is the happiest day of my life. I thought that was yesterday. Anyway, what's this intel you got? Check it out. Friday night near Bloom Park. Someone saw Renju. Friday night? That's when Shoko was killed. Hmm. Obviously, that's not enough to pin the crime on him. But it does prove he was there. I guess we should check the merry-go-round again. The police have already thoroughly searched it. And we've been there more than once before on our investigation. But we might have missed something, right? Sorry, never heard of them. Are they even real? Yes! Oh, yeah. I mean, uh, of course. <laughs> I've always known, deep down, there must be some kind of secret organization. Always known it. Anyway, I, I got some info about the shootout. Those guys aren't affiliated with any criminal organization we're aware of. They're not Mafia, or Yakuza, or anything. They must have been hired guns. Uh, by... Niza... Mattis. It's Niza it Laws! Alright, what about you? <clears throat> Well, that's random. I just thought she might be worrying. It's fine. She knows already. I told her I'm with you. I'm sure she's not worried. Maybe Mr. Okio was a part of Nice. What? Oh, sorry. I was just thinking out loud. What makes you think that? When hmm. we were at Sunfish Pocket, my friend said... Oh, there he is. <laughs> Iris. And then later, I almost got kidnapped by Nice. Was that just a coincidence? And not just that. When you found my corpse in the parallel world, you found it in an Okiara warehouse. Whoever killed me in that world was probably affiliated with Nice. That makes me think the Okioras and Nyes are connected. School? Today's Tuesday. It's not another holiday, is it? What are you, dense? Tessa was almost kidnapped. She can't be going to school now. I guess that's true, but... Maybe Nice ordered Mr. Okiara to help Number 89 escape. And Number 89 is an assassin. If he wanted to get rid of me, Mr. Okiara must have... If that's true, it could be related to Shoko's murder. Shoko must have found out about the organization. He killed her for getting too close and displayed the body as a warning. If you 
want to know more about knives, why not ask Ota? Remember what he said yesterday? Ota. I know about conspiracies and secret societies, too. I find that stuff fascinating. Good point. You might have more information for us. Alright, so we need to go to Bloom Park first. And we'll try and talk to Ota. Oh, then we have to go back to the statements estate. Transmitter. Moma, Iris's phone already has GPS. I know. But in case she gets caught and they throw away her phone or something, it's just an extra precaution. Put That's a pretty good precaution. Thank you. Neat. I might actually help. Who knows? I hope it'll be useful. Date, if anything happens to her. I'll make sure you regret it for the rest of your life. It'll be fine, relax. No, not the diner. We go to Bloom Park first, son of a bitch. <laughs> I guess we're doing this work. Make sure the dogs aren't like causing mayhem. It's the Huskies doing their thing, as usual. Freaking Huskies. <laughs> our neighbor's dogs causing wars with our dogs. Nice at laws. I see. It's not impossible. Do, 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 do. Why is she here? Well, Ota, um... Date, can I... Look, I was gonna let you have it, but under the circumstances. Date, can I... What are you talking about? Mizuki, of course. You've been neglecting her. Don't you think she's at her limit? Mizuki stayed at one of the mermaid's houses last night. She was twisting and turning all night. They had to sleep in the same bed so she'd calm down. She called me this morning so I could pick her up. Normally, she'd be in school, but Mizuki had the day off for morning. I thought that she shouldn't be alone. Why don't you try being nicer to Mizuki? 
I know she doesn't show it, but she's really hurting. She needs you, Date. She just doesn't want to trouble you. She's a remarkable, brave young girl. You should try to understand how she feels. I feel like we've been really busy trying to solve this case. <laughs> Definitely not cold. Not conditions often considered cold. Oh, just like my big brother. He's a hero who will help me out of any jam. He's really important to me. I like him a lot. How much? Three Earths worth. Yeah! Suki is like a cute little sister and and my favorite friend. I like her a lot. How much? About three universes worth. Aww. <laughs> hmm, she's trembling for some reason. out right now. I'm not sure where. Shopping, maybe. Where is your mother? Tessa is my hopes and dreams, my peace and my life, my light, my star, my sun, my goddess. She's like the laws of the universe itself, the embodiment of beauty. An angel, a lover, Sam. a cute master <laughs> on a body pillow, a guru, a wife, a soulmate, life itself. She's the object of my total devotion and worship. Should never hold anyone to that standard. I would ignore it. Yeah, dude, you have no like self-respect. If she calls for me, I'll be there. Thanks, Ota. That makes me happy. And a little creeped up. I've heard of them. Nizitlos, or Nize, is a satanic secret society. A satanic? Like a cult. They sacrifice children. While the sacrifice is up all night screaming, the cult performs ritual acts. Their ranks are full of politicians, intellectuals, and business tycoons. They've only been active for a few decades, but some say that they've grown to be the largest secret society in the world. An organization so big that it absorbed the Freemasons and the Illuminati. Oh, shit. But even though their membership is huge, no one knows who their leaders are. Like, you've heard of the Rockefellers and the Rothschilds, right? But for Nice, there's nothing. No one knows who's running the cult. My guess is that they're being led by a group of super geniuses. Ota doesn't know about the Watchet system or its connections to Nice. I 
Chris found out just why they're after her. Pieces fit. If you believe everything she said. Yeah. All right, Iris. Let's get going. You got it. Date. If something happens to Tessa, let me know, okay? I'll come help right away. Me too. I'll save you no matter what, I Me three. Thank you both. Promise me. I promise. All right, all three are exhausted. Let's go to Bloom Park. Back to Bloom Park. There's nothing here. Guess not. Boom, 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 boom. Wanna race, Dante? Race? What? We talked about it yesterday. You wanna challenge me? Well, sure. Maybe this will uh Yeah, let's do it! Get us to come across the evidence. So race around the merry-go-round? Right! Line up next to me! Okay, here we go! Ready? Set? So she definitely outran him. See? Told you. Iris is the messenger of the gods. You've earned your namesake. <laughs> Do you know a lot about mythology? Huh? You said that Iris is a goddess in Greek mythology. <clears throat> Three days ago, you were talking about Egyptian mythology. Horus is the Egyptian god of the sky and sun. The right eye is the eye of Ra, and that's the sun. The left eye is the eye of Wajet, and that one is the moon. Mythology? I actually don't know that much. Uncle taught me everything. Six years ago, I used to come here with someone all the time. I used to call him Uncle. Oh yeah, didn't he come up with Aset too? Yeah, that's right. That name is rooted in Egyptian mythology too. Or 
Osiris's arch enemy was Set, his uncle. His uncle? Osiris's little brother is Set, and his son is Horus. This Set was an awful guy. One day he tricked and killed Osiris by trapping him in a coffin. So naturally, Horus didn't take that well. Drat! I'll never forgive you, Uncle Set! On the other hand, Set didn't like having Horus around. Ugh, he's so annoying! Osiris said that I was supposed to be king. But now everyone's like, oh, Horus should be king. Are these idiots serious? Horus would be an awful king. Time to go to war! And so, a bloody war broke out. Just like that. And the winner was decided by a deadly game. What kind of game? They would disguise themselves as hippos, ford the river, and whoever gets to the other side first would win. That's what they decided. How oddly specific. So, for 80 years they fought. It was bloody and horrible. In the end, Horus won. Horus used a spear to cut off Set's foot and Wee Wee. Wee Wee? I believe she is referring to a male. Wait, why are you asking me? But Horus didn't come out of this unscathed. During the battle, Horus lost his left eyeball to Set. It's said that the left eye survived and traveled all over Egypt, gaining wisdom and experience. Horus had no idea that his left eye was wandering around on its own. What? Where did my eye go? Horus was totally bummed out. He went to see the god of wisdom, the moon, and time, Thoth. Damn, Set did that? That's brutal, dude. All right, I'll use my moon power to heal you up. Yay, thank you, Mr. Thoth. Okay, here it goes. Moon healing power. Ring, ring, ring! Thoth cast his spell and Horus's eye came zooming in! Zoom, click! Horus got his eye back! Alright, um... And from that day forward, his left eye had the power of the moon in it! It became the symbol of knowledge and healing, and revered as a I sacred think. icon! So that's the Eye of Wadjet? Right. And it became the Eye of Providence? Yes! And do you think that's why we call it the Wadjet system? Probably, yeah. I told you yesterday, I love moving around. And I especially love dancing! But... Hmm? About three months ago, Mr. Ogira told me something. He said that I can't dance. Why? I don't know. He said something about being over-reliant on dancing and neglecting my singing. You should stop dancing for now and practice singing. But during your live stream... She was dancing. Because I was... sad. After I stopped dancing, I lost so many fans. They said terrible things to me, like that I'm worthless if I can't dance. All I have Pretty is brutal. dancing. <clears throat> Just dancing. Horus's mom is named Isis, but in ancient Egyptian, it's pronounced closer to Isa or Asa. Hmm. How do I explain this? I told you about Horus's dad, Osiris. His mom's name is Isis. So Osiris is Isis's husband. Osiris was assassinated by his brother Set. That's what I told you earlier, but there's more to it. After Set killed Osiris, he tore his body to pieces and threw it in the river. Isis was devastated. I can't believe I'm a widow at my age. But she didn't let it break her, because she had the power of life and death. All right, fine. If that's how it's gonna be, I'll just revive my husband. With a group of her friends, she gathered up Osiris's body and started the resurrection ritual. Live! Shh, -kr! And so, Osiris was revived! Well, technically he wasn't 
all there, so he wasn't in one piece. But anyway, Isis was the goddess of life, death, and fertility. She was worshipped by all the land. I think I get the picture. But what does that have to do with your own name? There's a theory that the Greek goddess Iris is really based on the Egyptian goddess Isis. So Isis and Iris are connected? Yeah. And Isis sounded like Aset in ancient Egyptian, which is where your stage name comes from. That's right. But remember, I didn't come up with the name. Her uncle. No new information about on Riju. Bah. Bah. But we learned a lot about G Egyptian mythology. Let's get going, Iris. Yeah, let's go. Alright, one more stop. See where this goes. To be honest, he did kind of do a loose threatening. He saw us again. Be the last thing you ever wish. <clears throat> There's no one in the garden. So must be inside. Wait, I have detected a living organism in the garden. You should look around. Oh. So there's someone here. Oh, over there. Zoom. Oh my god. That's so. Next to him is. It told me? It looks that way. Why? What's it told me doing with so? Date? What's wrong? You said you don't know So Sejima, right? Right, I don't. What about your mom? Does she know So? I don't know. I don't think she does. Do you ever talk politics at home? Anything like that? Not particularly. Why are you asking me this? It's time to walk over there. Uh, it looks like the bodyguards are uh, going to stop us. We told you, you can't come in here. You can't do what you want just because you're a cop. You're trespassing. That's a crime, you know. Get lost. tell anyone we were going there they won't be waiting for us besides they wouldn't ambush us in the same place twice but why marble no reason i just need to talk to mama hmm? yeah we need to talk to mama
Sorry I couldn't come last night. No, no, don't worry about it. It was better that you didn't. Huh? You didn't hear? There was a shootout right in front of the bar. They closed all of Golden Yokocho down. They were saying something about hitmen suddenly pulling out guns and shooting. They were trying to kill a man and a woman. Wait a minute. Speaking of, <laughs> connected to dots. <clears throat> Oh, let's talk to her first. Want a drink? No, I'm okay. Mama, what are you doing? Hmm, just polishing the bonito. It is not well known, but dried bonito is a fermented food. They are boiled and dried, which attracts a particular mold as it ages. It takes between three to four mold attraction sessions and results in high quality bonito. Mama is cleaning off the mold right now. Oh. So it's not just like she's actually doing that for a purpose. She's a delight. No, oh, aren't you nice? Are you looking for a job? <laughs> Iris is still in high school. How about after you graduate? Starting rate is six million yen an hour. Date, I need a body so I can work here immediately. You won't get hired looking like that. Sorry for the late introduction. This is Iris. Nice to meet you. Set. You bet! Oh, sorry. Have it. I meant Iris. Oh my, you are so cute! Are you a virgin? You are right. Oh, well, yeah. What a coincidence. Me too. <laughs> oh, you don't say. I think they must be foreign mafia. Some kind of international organization. They would do anything for money. Nice must have hired them. Sorry, honey, but I don't know a thing about that. You're an informant. I'm sure you must know something. I'm well versed in local information. I know all about Tokyo's underworld, but I can't say much about the rest of the world. Mama, I want to ask you something. What is it? Those gunmen were waiting for us. Did you tell anyone we were coming? That's right. You did tell Mama that you were coming. And that you were bringing Iris. True, true. Hmm. Well, I did tell one person. Who? The person I was going to have you meet, of course. Same guy who gave Ren his watch. What's his name? Mm. Futa, I think. Futa. Futa Amanoma. <gasps> what? Oh. So. The boss or Pewter is behind this. I mean, Pewter does wear some evil villain shit. If you think about it. <laughs> All right, so we're going to headquarters at seven. There's no one here. Maybe he went home. No, that can't be. Pewter is definitely around here somewhere. Date, your intuition is correct. I am detecting a living organism nearby. Oh, shit. So someone is here. 
So near the door. It's kind of dark here. Door to the sink room. Is Pewter in here? <laughs> Can't be in the shelves. No, he's not. Shelves. Long table. Take this search. Okay, okay. Could he be in the lockers? X-ray. He's hiding in a locker. What the fuck is wrong with him? There's that bastard. Wait a minute. Uh, okay, I'll tell you everything. I was eating Twinkies. <laughs> I you cheated on my diet. That Iris and I were going to Golden Yokocho, didn't you? Yes, I did. Renju hired them. Renju did? Which means Mr. Okiura is in with Nice. Nice? Don't play dumb. I know you're with them. I don't know what you're talking about. I was just helping Renju. Did you help number 89 get away? How much does she know? Just answer the question. Yes, I did. It's been bothering me. How was number 89 able to escape from Metro so easily? And you were the one being held hostage. If you were helping him the whole time, it all makes sense. Two days ago, Renju escaped from the hospital. Renju asked me on the phone to report everything about Shoko's murder case. That's what he wanted. Yesterday, the boss told me that number 89 was coming. Then, Renju asked, Is there any way we can let number 89 escape? I was conflicted. I thought hard about it, but it was Renju asking. Someone I love. And he sounded like he was on death's doorstep. He was begging for help. I couldn't say no. With my intelligence, I was quickly able to come up with a plan. You know what the results were. The escape happened exactly how I described earlier. Though, I wasn't being threatened with a gun. You were acting, huh? Just pretending to be his hostage. Yes. Did number 89 know about the plan? Of course. We discussed it when we were alone in the interrogation room. Mm. Naturally, he agreed. I imagine he would have taken any possibility of escape. Even if we failed, he was already serving a life sentence. I may not look it, but I have connections high up at HQ. Friends from my college days. I asked one of them to call up the boss. Is it true that you were the one who gave Renju his watch? Yes. Uh. It's true. I don't know. It's true. Please, believe me. Renju said that he needed him. That's all I know. I see. So where is Renju? Even if I knew, why would I tell you? Because you don't want more holes in your body than you already have. You can't. Why not? Date, I didn't tell you all this because you were threatening me. <laughs> 